into a scenario in which Iran makes an empire. The first thing Iran does is go to war with Iraq. And, well, it marches in. The successor to the Persian Empire making an Iranian Empire. And they take the south out pretty fast. Well, because they're an empire, so they can take everything out quick. Well, they annex all of Iraq. Well, they love expansionism. They invade in the Kuwait. Saudi Arabia says no. Know who else says no? Oh, man. The UAE. Qatar says nothing. Jordan declares war. Well, Iran quickly swoops right through Kuwait and starts an offensive in the Saudi Arabia into the desert. They then start a swift offensive into Jordan. Push down the coast. And then they land in Oman and the UAE. Big landing. And they push down. They take out the country. They push towards Riyadh. Well, Well, Saudi Arabia also made an empire. I may be wrong in the position of Riyadh, but I think it's in the center. Riyadh falls, so they continue pushing until they surround Mecca. And well, Saudi Arabia has become a big desert. Saudi Arabia falls. Oh man, kind of leaves the war. with Iran annexing some land down the Saudi Arabia under the Red Sea. A lot of land down this way. Saudi Arabia gets transformed into a puppet. All of this gets annexed. And then they annex these lands. Well, I guess they are a really strong empire now. Strong enough to take out Pakistan? I don't think so, but yeah. They leave Q8 guitar alone because, well, they just do. Well, they've made a alliance with Qatar, but since empires are all liars, all the empires I made have invaded allies. So why don't we just eradicate them? Hmm. They declare war on Turkey, but who knew it would spark all of Turkey's allies to get involved? Oh yeah, Turkey is pretty bad with allies. So they're all ready for invading Turkey. Pakistan kind of just sits there because, well, they're preparing. But little do they know. Like, in every video, there's a surprise for them. India. And guess who joins? Afghanistan, hmm? Like, in every video, it's pretty normal. You don't know, like how the it's going. 
Oh, I did get 92 views yesterday. Thank you, all you viewers. Please subscribe, viewers. You know, subscribing is awesome. You know what it feels like to have someone subscribe? Ooh, bitch. We need 30 subscribers. We're going to do a 30 subscriber special. As well, 30 subscribers is awesome. I'm going to sweep through Tur Anatolia. Oh, who knew? Not while that was happening. Well, on this front, the Pakistan front, well, this happened. They pushed in. They were fighting on this front, yeah. India was already here. Yeah, as well, Pakistan is pretty. It's not the strongest country. They pushed up here. India pushed in here. Well, no. At this point, this is what Pakistan looks like. No, no. The rest of Pakistan falls. And then, well, you guessed what happened to Azerbaijan. Well, quickly and swiftly, Azerbaijan fell. Well, they invade Armenia, because why not? Well, then they pushed into Turkmenistan. Turkmenistan is awesome. No, they don't invade Bhutan. Pretty smart. You know what the strongest nation in the world is? Hmm. None other than Afghanistan. Impossible to invade. Or is it Ukraine? Impossible to invade. Or is it? Well, Israel. Or is it impossible this nation to invade? Vietnam. Or is it Poland? Hmm. Well, eventually, well, for some reason, all the Iran starts fighting like guerrilla fighters. And, well, they take it over. Ethiopia is also impossible to invade. Canada, obviously. Well, they take a big chunk out of the Anatolian Peninsula. Honestly, the coast. This area can just be a puppet. Now, you know most Azeris live in Iran. Most pretty cool. They take a lot of land out of well, these nations. India gets a lot more out of Pakistan because, well, who fought the hardest in Pakistan and who took over the most land? India. Well, they have their final campaign. Well, they have. A few more left. They declare war on Egypt, Israel, and they get the Israel. Well, they invade Palestine, and they invade Israel quickly somehow. Now oh, are they invading all the impossible to invade countries? Well, they manage to push into Egypt within months. They have basically all of Egypt's population. So well, Egypt surrenders, because why not? Oh, 
Well, they popped up the rest of Egypt as well. Why not? They already want us. Well, they have a bit of betrayal left to do. Well, they're two allies. Well, what do they decide to do to allies? Beat them up. Push in this area on every front. Push in Lebanon quickly. Then they just land on Cyprus and annex it. And, well, that's it for this video. Please like and subscribe. And this is what would happen if Iran made an empire. Wild Mapper!